live anymore. Hail, earthquakes, hurricanes. It has made for some nice rainbows. I hope you have caught some of them anyway. Well, moving on, indoors the Moravian College women's volleyball team hosting Penn State Burks last night in a non-conference matchup in Bethlehem. The Greyhounds entering with an overall record of 11 and 7, while the Nittley Lions were an impressive 10, 10 and 1, riding an eight-match win streak. Here's Mike Brusco with the highlights. Early in the opening set, Bethlehem Catholic grad Kelly Brown finds junior outside hitter Samantha Savate for the kill, and Moravian takes a 3-1 to one lead. Later on, it's Brown again, this time to Jean Ann Carey, who hits right through the block to make it 15-8 to eight in favor of the home team. The defense shows up late in the set for the Hounds as Carey and Brittany O'Hara combine for the block, and it's all Moravian. They take the opener 25-11. to 11. In set number two, the Lions showcase some effective serving, first from another former Golden Hawk, Rachel Sweeney, and then Emmaus alum, Victoria Young. Late in the set, Burks leads 24 to 21 when former Parkland standout Kayla Mosser takes the pass and hammers it home to tie things up at one set apiece. But Moravian would settle in in the third set as this connection between Brown and Katie Moquette puts them up 12 to 8 and if some is good, more is better. A few minutes later, it's the same two hooking up with the same result as Moquette gets another of her 11 kills on the night. Then with Moravian leading 21 to 17 in the third, fans were treated to an incredible rally between the two teams in a point that lasted for a minute and three seconds. Beautiful defense from both sides, most notably young for the Lions, but when all is said and done, it's Brown showing she can do more than pass, and the Greyhounds win the point and the set 25 to 17. Fourth set action here when Carey gets one of her eight kills to put her team up 20 to 18, and on match point, Maria Pavone's shot goes wide as Moravian hangs on to win it 25 to 23. I thought we came out very well the first game. We came out with a lot of energy. The second game, we thought we I think we had it in the bag, so we like played a little less and with less energy. Then the third and fourth game, we knew that we had to come out and win, and we tried our best and we accomplished it. It's great to get W anytime. Uh, it was parents' night for us, so I'm happy that all of our players played. And uh, we have a big conference weekend this weekend, so we're excited to start that on a strong foot and uh, get a couple W's this weekend as well. So the Greyhounds get back on track after losing two in a row entering tonight's match, and they do so against a Penn State Burks team that had dropped just five sets in 11 previous matches this season. With the win, Moravian now holds a 12 and seven overall record as they prepare to begin conference play this weekend. On the scene in Bethlehem, Mike Brusco, Two sports. Right, thanks, Michael. Eight match win streak for Penn State. Burks out the window and nice momentum for Moravian going into the lead play. Yeah, doing a good job there and a big victory, that's for sure.